So no, he didn't give me flowers or candy. He gave me the moon and the stars. Infinity. The belly comet is the sun, and when the sun comes out, the stars disappear. I don't just need somebody. Now, Jarrell, run the road again! Damn it, it's cut! You don't have anybody to flat! You don't actually have to swear on a Christian Bible, you can swear on anything, really. But you did a good job at really fucking up my day. And then you said you made steak. Nigga, that was banquet, Salisbury steak. You done fed me a TV dinner? Mashed potatoes, cold as fuck in the middle. I ain't got no more power. consider myself to be a particularly ethical person, but I am fair. I killed them all. They're dead. Every single... Chosen, we chose the most expensive one. Just like how he's so angry with everything that 
he needs or like wants Dudley to punch him or he needs something to like get his anger out. Again, it breaks my heart that this is a kid going through this with no one at this time, no one there to help him. <sighs> I think I was right, girl. That little glass of wine ain't gonna do nothing. I need something stronger. Don't worry. This is just the beginning. Today's episode of where I put my reading light to get the optimal reading position, I actually have just clipped it to the little knob. Hmm, this is good guys. The little knob on my scarf because last time I, I had a bonnet on, this time I didn't feel like wearing a bonnet. I wanted my hair to be laid. You get what I'm saying? So now we, we've adapted and this is the situation that we, we have going on. Last time y'all told me I look like an angler fish. I can neither confirm nor deny that statement. Thank you. I killed them all. They're dead. Every single one of them. I killed them all. They're dead. Every single one of them. Marceline, is it just you and me in the red cube? Hey, I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. I get no bitches. Absolutely zero play. Can you believe that this is an Airbnb? Like, this is the entrance to the Airbnb. As in, this is your front door. Crazy. And it's inside St. Paul's Cathedral in a secret hidden room. So let me show you it. Hello, MTV, and welcome to the library. <laughs> I feel like I'm in Saltburn, except not naked yet. Like, imagine having this as your reading nook. You come around this corner and look at this this is incredible so this is the airbnb it's a hidden library at st paul's cathedral and this is my favorite part it's a tiny version if i was a lego man or a worm this is where you would find me and then here is the big version the, the people size version a sliding ladder has always been my biggest dream like i will know i've been successful in this life if i have a sliding ladder in my house this space has twenty-two thousand books that is my fantasy. I wonder what's around here. Oh, <laughs> okay. Good for swingers, I guess. <laughs> there are so many hidden compartments. This one has a typewriter in it. Look, this is so cool. This room is my type on paper. Thank you very much. I feel like I'm on like a TV real estate show, like this stunning home in the heart of central London. <laughs> and the coolest thing is someone actually gets to stay here. Am I allowed to jump on the bed? I got the green flag. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. Sorry, Airbnb. I fixed it, I swear. Well, I'm moving in, so, um, thanks for watching, and I'll, I'll see you later. <laughs>
vapor. Ain't got a bitch, but it's a razor.